Let's take a look at what's trending. Kim Kardashian West, for one, she's all over social media, but not for the usual reasons. The reality star was robbed at gunpoint in her private rental apartment in Paris. Five men in ski masks and police jackets were involved in the robbery at about 3 a.m. local time. Two of the men bound Kardashian's hands and feet with tape, then locked her in the bathroom before taking valuables worth several millions of dollars, including jewelry and two cell phones. Kim's husband, Kanye West, interrupted a performance in New York when he received the news. The world's first bionic games get underway within days, with competitors from 65 countries taking part. The Cybathlon event is scheduled to kick off October 8th in Zurich, Switzerland. It's organized by the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology. The games are funded and supported by universities and companies that specialize in technologies to assist disabled people. Organizers hope that by showcasing the technology in a competitive environment, a global audience will see which bionics are best, most efficient and effective. And in other technology news, this time in China, you know, smog routinely blankets the streets of China's cities, but a Dutch artist is offering an eccentric solution to China's air pollution problems. He's created a seven-meter metal structure that takes in smog and breathes out cleaner air. The smog-free tower is comprised of 45 silver plates. It contains an air purifying machine that catches smog particles and turns them into pitch black powder. According to the latest report from the World Health Organization, China is the world's deadliest country for outdoor air pollution. And that is what's trending.